Hey everyone, Jake here, going through some of the basic WordPress functionalities, um, specifically focusing on the menu today. And the menu being this right here. As you can see, I've added a few pages. Um, we now have a privacy policy on our site, so basically if we're going to run ads or anything else that we want to let users know, we've got that on there. But uh, in adding and changing the names, um, you can see we've, we've kind of discombobulated our menu here. We've got the blog before the actual home page. And typically you want the home page on the furthest left so people can click it, go to your home page, and so on and so forth. So it's actually it is uh, not organized to where it's it's user friendly. It's we're gonna we're gonna be talking about uh, how to actually modify just the basic menu they give you. It looks like right now it's it's set up for um, it's set up to be uh, alphabetical. And then uh, we, but there's ways to change that. And then the next tutorial, I'm going to run through custom menus and some of the added functions you can do with that. So let's go to the back end of WordPress. And where we're going to go is actually we're going to go to the pages menu. And so as we click into that, you can see we've got uh, the blog, home, privacy. And here again, it looks like it's alphabetically organized for us. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to the one that we want first ordered are basically for farthest on the left and go to edit and then over to the right here you can see we've got the page attributes we're gonna go to order and we're gonna leave we're, we're gonna we're gonna actually put this one as one and then we're gonna update that once that updates we'll go back into the pages menu and now what we're gonna do is we're gonna find the one that we want right next to it to the right or the second order which is the blog we're gonna go to into the edit there and we're gonna change that order to number two and then we're gonna go and do that one more last time with the privacy policy being the furthest right or third ordered under the page attributes update that and then we're gonna go refresh our blog and see where we're at there we go. So you can see that's the easy way is if you want to stick with the default menu and how it's set up, you can actually just go into each individual page and give it an attribute of the order you'd like them in. So one being home, two being blog, and three being privacy policy. So that gives your, your blog and your, your website a little bit more feel, a little bit more usability when you're uh, organizing the pages on the menu. Stay tuned, we're going to be going over how to do a custom menu, and that gives you a little bit more functionality. Again, makes it a little bit more user-friendly if you want to do some added functionality to it. So check out the next video, and uh, you know, again, if you have any questions or anything uh, you want us to go over, subscribe and shoot us an email or uh, leave us a comment. So.